When I first got started turning wood, actually, I usually tell people uh, I started turning when I decided that uh, being a psychologist isn't what I wanted to do, and literally just saw an article on, uh, on wood turning and bought an old Myford ML8. Probably my biggest enjoyment is, is showing other people how to, how to do things, how to do projects, and, and I think a lot of like, the things that I do are things that people can look at and go, ah, I can do that. I'm a technician, I suppose, more than, more than an artist, and I'm very happy to be that way. So one of the important things for me is that the nose of that gouge is nicely rounded, because when you start to cut a cove like this, if it's not, you can't make a, uh, a smooth curve. And what I'm doing here is just I'm looking how much is the overhang and I'm going to go to the Sorby texturing tool because I'm a little bit lazy and I don't want to sand and it just gives a nice uh, a nice effect uh, on, on the roof if you do it right. And that is too loose. We're going to try a paper towel. Let's see how that works. This is one of those tools, like I said, I think probably about 90 bucks. So you got to make a lot of uh, ornaments in order to pay for it, but there's a lot of other uses for this too. Okay, so there you can see. And a little bit of accelerator. Uh, I will make these in batches and spray them with, oh, usually a satin lacquer.